Hey guys, for today's video, we are gonna be doing heatless rag curls. Surprisingly, I've never tried this method, so let's try it and let's go ahead and get started. So I am just going to dampen my hair a little bit. I'm just gonna use a leave-in conditioner. The pump on it broke, so I'm just gonna use my hands. I don't want my hair super damp because I don't want my hair to get like kinky. I'm also just gonna use my favorite oil. This is by Verb. I use this every single night. It helps to smooth my hair so I don't wake up with a frizzy hot mess. All right, so all I'm gonna do is section off my hair and this is what I'm using, just rags cut up into big chunks. So I start at the bottom and I just basically put it in the middle of the rag and roll that rag up. You can see how my hair kind of falls out so I just grab it back and add it back in as I'm wrapping it up towards the top. And you just roll, 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 get it as close to your head as you can. And you just want to take the ends, and I didn't show this very well, but you just tie a knot, like, you know, you're tying a shoe. Super easy. So then you just keep repeating that all throughout your head. I think I used a total of maybe eight or ten. I don't know. I lost track. But these are old rags, and honestly, they needed to be thrown away anyways. So we're just putting them to good use, honestly. I do believe my grandma used this method back in her day, so hopefully they work. So we are all wrapped up, so I will do a 360 and show you guys what this looks like before I go to bed and take it out in the morning. Looking back, I probably should have added some heatless curls in the back of my head, but that's okay. Hello, it is the next morning. I am in the same shirt, I don't even care. <laughs> but we are gonna take these out. Honestly, they weren't too bad to sleep in. I mean, I sleep pretty fine. I'm usually a side sleeper and a back sleeper. So when I first did this curl, this is kind of the curl I was expecting, sort of. I wasn't expecting like a beach wave or anything, more of like a vintage -y curl. And that's exactly what I got here. Right off the bat, this is like a very, well first off, what's going on right here? I must not have wrapped that end part, but this is giving very like 50s, 60s. So as I kept rolling, I was thinking maybe I was gonna get like a Hollywood waves type of vibe, you know what I'm talking about? Those old school Hollywood waves. But as I kept going, I was like, mm, I don't know. This is looking a little sketchy. Okay, here's what we are working. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> this is crazy. Um, I don't even know where to start with this. Honestly, I'm so scared to brush these out. First, I got to fix my part line. Oh, boy. This is, I feel like this isn't going to turn out good. Oh, no. Honestly, my motto is just brush. Brush your hair. Brush those things out because if you keep brushing, it's bound to look good, right? So I know people say, use your fingers, use your fingers. No, don't do that. Brush, these are the type of curls you need to brush and you need to kind of finagle and work with and really kind of just manipulate. So I felt like I was kind of getting those Hollywood wave type vibes as I was brushing. Wait a minute, this isn't bad, right? I mean, obviously this isn't like robe curls. Robe curls are like my ride or die. I love that method, but like if we're wanting to switch up how we want our hair to look, I don't know. This is fun. You know, kind of play around with it for a minute. Let me try to put some oil in my hair. I mean, it definitely, it has potential, okay? It has potential. I always see photos of women in like the 30s and 40s, 50s, 60s, and they just had the most stunning hair. It's like, girls, Give us a hair tutorial if you're still around. Okay, I'm trying to manipulate this the best way that I can just by brushing it over and over, hoping maybe something will come of it. Let me, let me show you what it looks like from the back. Womp, womp, womp. Not every hairstyle I do can be amazing. Not everything I try can work perfectly. So this is a great example, but we tried it and now I know I will probably never do these again, but I might experiment with like how I wrap my hair around them. I'm just not going to roll them up again. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like this? Would you wear this? Is this too much? Are we just going to like pretend we never saw this video? You let me know, but don't forget to like, subscribe, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.